hustlers make sure to stay till the end of the video because I'll be revealing you guys how I'm currently making money off of flipping business and also I will finally reveal you guys my business partner who is it stay tuned and you'll see hustlers what's up wow I'm about to show you an invoice I just created from the business the flipping business I'm working with flipping 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 yeah see I'm about to send this invoice to my I'm gonna show you right now look at this I can't show too much though beautiful San Diego you see I'm about to show you this money I just made I what I'm about to make I'm sending an invoice he's gonna pay it off Ooh. see that invoice one thousand dollars yeah you would think, oh damn, he 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 he's making money, he's making bread, he's lying. How is he homeless? He's doing that. Like I told you, I've been doing business for a while. I just started last year. Anyways, this is not I didn't pay, but out of that 1,050, out of that right there, out of that 1,000 and let me see, 54, I I would say 70% of it is profit. 30% of it is actually spend. Is my uh, amount spend um, from advertising, buying the products and stuff like that. You know, um, that's what I'm trying to tell you guys, man. This is not to brag, but uh, actually, this took me actually a month to do, so I'm not really making a lot of money. But it's gonna start increasing next month. I made a goal; I'm gonna make 2,500, and I'm pretty, pretty, pretty sure I'm gonna do it. Cause I said, uh, and cause I said this month I'm gonna make $1,000 profit, and it's the 23rd, the 23rd. So I got seven days. I'm pretty much gonna make the profit, 1,000. I made that goal this month, and I reached it. Uh, next month I'm gonna do. 2500 so that's one thing you guys should do set goals for the month of what you want to do there's there's something called your subconscious mind and honestly when you actually keep telling yourself this your subconscious mind actually believes it and pushes you towards it so um yeah and my business partner does it and it works so yeah this business is just flipping uh flipping products but uh i go around putting flyers out i do facebook ads i do craigslist but i'm not doing facebook because my my fucking uh my my account got banned but uh, I'm about to start doing internet marketing for it too. I'm about, I'm about to do internet referrals. You guys can do this too, right? Right? You better say yes. Yeah. Um, this is just for flipping, man. Flipping. Go, if you need, this is this all this money I'm going to do, make with, I'm going to put that into the hustle. The website, the marketing, the business. So, you know, that's, that's all I'm doing this for, you know? And by the way, nobody needs to send me a donation or nothing because I'm not going to take any donation because I believe about, you know, I need to grind. I need I need to grind like I'm broke. That's why I don't take stuff from people. The only thing I need it, like right now is the SSI. So I take that. But anything more than that is too much. And I'm actually cutting it off, by the way. I'm actually cutting off my SSI. I'm cutting my SSI off. Look at that. I'm cutting the SSI off. Look at that beautiful site. This is where I work. Let me show you. This is that chair. That chair, that chair right there, I usually have it right here near the thing machine and I work. But because of the coronavirus, the school is closed and I just look at that big ass thing, San Diego, California. The second biggest city, the second biggest city in, that's the second biggest city in California. People don't know that. They think San Francisco or Oakland is the biggest. No, second biggest is San Diego and it's probably the nicest looking one. Downtown San Diego is freaking nice. Yes baby um what i was gonna say what was i gonna say oh shit oh shit you guys i just man i, I just watched the video again to see what i said and i realized i had white stuff in my mouth again I know I look like a fucking bum or weird, whatever, drug addict, but that's because I'm taking uh, my medication right now. I'm taking my medic. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Oh, I, can't I forgot. It was dark that side. So that's because I'm taking my medication right now. So the wholesaler, beautiful San Diego, the wholesaler actually accepted the invoice. He, that's gonna happen though. They accept everyone's invoice. The wholesaler is the person I sell my my uh, items to, the or items I buy. I just flipping, you know. You get a wholesaler. So, look at this. Let's get to it. 
All right, where is the PayPal? I got to All right, see, 1,000. The invoice was accepted. 1,000, when is the date right now? 24, I think I had the date when I showed you guys the invoice, right? It got accepted. And I made around 700 profit from this 1,000, so $300 spent. So so let me, let me. I'm clicking, I'm gonna, I gotta click. By the way, guys, that psychology thing you thought about the assumptions, that's actually something I'm using right now for my anxiety problem and my uh, self-esteem problem. And I'm also, the great thing about this, I've been doing this since I was 13 and uh, it's making me, it's making me better. And for my business too, I implement to my, I implemented to my business. I put it on my business. So yeah, here you see that. Um, I can't, you know, I got actually covered the name. I'll let you see a little bit. East, East. See, the first one I created that was my first time creating an invoice, so I messed up. It was my first invoice. I didn't know how to do that shit, so I created this invoice right here. It said paid. You remember? One hundred fifty-three. And again, this is just for this month. And um, I was barely even working. Now I'm working hard. So my goal is to make twenty-five hundred, two thousand five hundred. Yes, sir. Sup, man? You see the car? My new car? It's a Kia. How sleep in their eyes? Oh yeah. Now I'm just fucking with you guys. Ha <laughs> <laughs> Your boy Moses six one nine. It's a new watch. It's a new watch. No, it's man. I got this motherfucker. Show me your face, man. Yo, what's up? What's up, man? How you sleep on the rise? That's a true, true entrepreneur right here. Yeah. Hi, you. You know. Uh, what up? By the way, that's not my car. I'm just effing with you guys. Uh, yeah, now right here, we were out here working, you know what I'm saying, grinding, putting up flyers, doing our thing, you know, like entrepreneurs do for Hush Loop and all the businesses that yeah, we're I'm doing. Yeah, see, I'm trying to, I'm telling you guys, I'm trying to right now, I'm trying to get this money, and it's happening, uh, and put it in Hush Loop, the social network, and grow it, you know, revenue. I don't think about money for my, well, yeah, I think about it for myself, but I also think about putting it somewhere, you know, that's really what money is, what you're going to use it with, not because you want to be rich. That's the intrinsic reason. I use it, you know, that's an that's the external reason, extrinsic. We use it in intrinsic, internal, meaning for us, for our family, those motives. Yeah, yep. So right now we're just out here trying to get some money. We got a business that we're doing. We get out here grinding, putting out some flyers. You guys know about flyers. We just out here yeah. passing them out, putting them up, and getting it done. Yeah. So, you know, that's I, I told you I had that business partner. This is him. So that's why my success comes fast, because I implemented uh, a, a strategy from the book called Napoleon Hill, uh, Dick and Grow Rich. It's called the Mastermind Alliance. And I thought about it. See, when I read something, I don't just read for stuff. I do it. You know, that's why I get success. That's why success comes to people like that apply what they learn. You don't just, there's so many smart people that just read all day. Like my brother, he reads all day, but like you got to apply these things. And I applied it. And guess what? I, I, uh, our, my business, the business we're doing goes so fast because we have two people working on it. In fact, we actually uh, we actually brought another person, you know, third one person. One thing I want to tell them too is yeah. that, like, my boy Moses is creative. I'm creative too. If you're not a creative person, you don't have to worry about that. You got to find somebody that's creative because he's going to come with ideas and that I, those ideas are going to help your business grow faster. Some ideas might not be great ideas, but at least he's coming up with ideas. So it's good right. to connect with someone that's creative. We're just fortunate enough that me and my mastermind alliance, Moses, are the team that we got. They're, we're all creative. But if you got other people, I think... By creative, he means uh, idea generating, not like creative, like drawing arts. Not that. We're talking yeah. about like, think ideas. of ideas. Well, honestly, that doesn't really matter. You don't have to be creative in business to, to, to see. Because I was... Be there was find someone, right? Yeah, it helps. It helps. That's yeah. why. But don't worry about that, though. That's good if you get it, but you want... To, People, if you're not a creative person, you have regular creativity in your mind, you're just regular. All you would need, if you were to die that takes action, think simple and thinks big, that's just better than somebody who's creative, doesn't think simple, and doesn't, doesn't think, think big, and doesn't take action. You'll do much better than him. Yeah. So creativity is just a tool, you know? In this game, you, it's about taking action, uh, believing in yourself, and all that, you know? These are principles. You gotta, you gotta watch stuff. You gotta read stuff. The books are not there for a reason, but don't just read it and not do nothing. Take action, like what I do. I take information and I apply it. Why am I creating a social network like that? You know, you gotta think yourself. It's not because I'm scared of the unknown or a lot of people won't do what I'm doing because they're thinking, oh, this is too big, this that. No, I'm gonna do it, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm fearless with this, you know. And that's why we're getting success. He's, he's the same way too, you know. And one thing is though, if you have anything and you're still persistent, that's a good thing. 
Yeah. All right. Yeah. Hush loop on the rise. About to get back to the grind. Hush loop on the rise. Handshake yep. Kings. Handshake Kings. Up? Check out this handshake. This motherfucker just grew. He's growing. He had like Birdman's uh, Birdman's uh, nephew sent him a, a, a handshake. I'll leave this, his, his, his uh, Instagram page on the on the ground. I mean, on on <laughs> in the comments. <laughs> in the comments. <laughs> in the description. Yo, I'm thinking about the flyers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, All right. All right, you bitch ass niggas. No, I'm saying. <laughs> 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 nah, that's my. Those are the hustlers, bro. These are the oh, big ass bad, niggas. They're the big ass niggas. Right, then, then, then the big Hus ass niggas next to you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo. Always hustle. Yeah. yeah.